Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The site info panel lets you add both informational text and contact links to a web gallery. However, the fields available change depending on the currently selected template layout style. To add site information, expand the site info panel at the right side of the web module. Then replace the default text within the field shown in the panel or delete the information if you don't want it to appear. For the grid gallery templates, square gallery templates, and track gallery templates, you can specify the gallery title, gallery author, and a contact URL for the gallery author URL if you chose to add text to the gallery author field. The text within the gallery author field becomes the URL to which a user is directed when they click the hyperlinked gallery author field. To not apply a hyperlink, simply delete the gallery author URL text. To add a contact email address link, you can add the text mail to colon someone at someplace.com where someone at someplace.com is your contact email address. Additionally, the Square Gallery templates contain an extra info field which adds additional on-screen text to the gallery. For the Classic Gallery templates, you can specify the site title, collection title, collection description, contact info, a web or mail link for the contact info if used, an identity plate, and another web or mail link for the identity plate if used. Like the other templates, the web or mail link lets you specify a contact URL for the related contact info field or identity plate. To apply an identity plate, check the identity plate checkbox and then click the identity plate preview to select a saved identity plate or create and save a new identity plate from the drop down menu that appears. To review creating and saving identity plates, please review the earlier lesson titled Adding an Identity Plate to a Slideshow in the chapter named the Slideshow Module. Also note that after you add text to a field, you can then click the drop down that appears in the upper right corner of that field to select your choice in the future so you won't always need to retype contact information for the web galleries you create. To clear a field's drop down list of saved text choices, Click the Fields drop-down and then choose the Clear List command. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.